backyard. And I don't want to rain on anybody's parade, but... I saw you slip away. I was there, I saw it with my own eyes. I'm sorry. You were poisoned, Dixie. You died. Yes. Then how are you sitting here with me? I don't... No, I was... dead. Now I'm, I'm not. Well, I'm glad we sorted that out. <laughs> I, uh... I should have, like, a million questions, and I, 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 I can't think of one. I'm just so amazed you're here that it's... that it's you. But this is, uh... This is... This is beyond wild, Dix. I wish I could explain. I was at Oak Haven. Oak Haven? When? I remember that. No, I mean, when? Recently, I was I was at Oak Haven. I, I, I went there because of Opal and... I was right. You were there. Why? Dixie, why would you be at Oak Haven? You don't remember? Do you remember where you were before? back among the living. Now that would be nice. I was in love with her. Did you know that, Dr. Castillo? Would have done anything for her. For her, to her. It's just semantics, really, isn't it, Dave? He's right. I did go to some extremes out of love for an incredible woman. But you never got that love back. That must have hurt, huh? Mm. You know, with all my brilliance, I guess you can consider that my Achilles heel. Falling for women who can't return my affections. Sorry, when did this become a, a therapy session? I asked you a question I wanted an answer. You see, this is exactly what I was talking about. Why I came up with the idea of a truce in the first place. Your great mentor feels like he's being ganged up on. Well, all I'm interested is the truth, Dr. H. Mm. All right, you know what? Happy sleuthing, gentlemen. Uh, I have more important things to do. Hold them. What the hell do you think you're doing? You promised me the truth. I'm just taking you at your word. Uh, Chad, uh, he was here. He must go now. Maybe he's helping Jesse track down the Oak Haven runaways. Well, that could be. Mm. Janet Dillon was brought in after the fire, and, um... She said the most interesting thing. Well, that doesn't surprise me. What's <laughs> no, that old cuckoo head been waxing <laughs> on about now? Oh. She said Dixie's alive. That's hogwash. I was at Oak Haven yesterday. I saw plenty of Janet and not hide nor hair of Dixie. No, that poor soul. She is dead and gone. I'm so sorry, Mandy. You know, for someone who wanted so desperately to be a mother, I didn't do a very good job, did I? You tried. Not hard enough. You know, you. I've seen you with little Trevor. He's the light of your life, and he knows it. But he's not the only light. And he knows that, too. And for that, that makes you a million times the mother I ever could be. Well, your mama's right about that. You are the best mom I've, I've ever known. And if Trevor is the only child that the two of you ever have, 
then it's God's will and his blessing, too. I think we want a bigger brood, so we'll adopt. We'll adopt 10 if we have 20. We'll adopt 20. Sky's the limit. <laughs> okay, now that may be pushing it. <laughs> Everything is going to work out, Mandy. I know it is. You. So you're going to be there for? Every step of the way. Good. Then you do what I couldn't. <laughs> you take care of my little girl. But your mom's okay. Well, yeah, yeah, that is the craziest part. I mean, she's more herself than she's been in weeks. That's the craziest part, huh? Oh, good point. Statement withdrawn. <laughs> Look at you with the lawyer speak. Oh, my girlfriend taught me well. Your girlfriend, huh? Oh. Is that too much too soon? No, it's long overdue. <sighs> What's wrong? I don't know, I'm just... Here we are again, you know? David responsible for yet another unspeakable stunt. Oh, come on, don't take on any of his garbage. Right. Tell me what I can do to help. You're already helping. Mm. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I, 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 I didn't mean to. Walk into your, into your own living room? It's okay. <laughs> if anyone should apologize, it's no, just... Don't you dare. I am so happy for you guys. Really. It's obvious you were meant to be together. Zach, I need you. I need you to wake up. <sighs> Please, don't make me do this. Don't make me decide whether or not to disconnect this thing. Wake up. I know you have it in you. Think about Kendall. Think about Spike. Think about Ian. Think about your family, Zach. Open up your eyes and come back to them. Thanks for coming over. Yeah, but you've got a lot to deal with. I'll talk to you later. Oh, uh, yeah, definitely. Okay, good. Uh, uh, wait, 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 what, what? You just got here. I know, but I couldn't stay anyway. I promised AJ a rematch in Cars Traffic Jam before bed. I got to level seven last time. Wow, that's impressive. I know, I'm pretty good at this. I thought it was pretty yeah. good, too. Yeah, so bye, Kendall. Bye, bye. I, um, I'll call you. Okay, bye. I'm sorry. For what? For running Marissa out of here like that. She probably thinks I'm a basket case. No, she doesn't. Well, she should. Hey, you're upset. And, and it's all my fault. Okay, it was stupid and, and insensitive of me to, to bring up Zach. I just, I, I, I can't, I can't go there. I can't. It's too much. I thought if anyone would understand that. Okay, I do, I do understand. I know, you want to just move on with your life. I'm sorry if, if I made it any harder. You didn't. It's already hard enough. <sighs> David had me on God knows what kind of drugs and... He must be doing the same thing to you. I will not be responsible for your death twice. Okay? This is going to work. Doctor, you are today. Hey, bingo. Oh, God. Would you just give me that, please? Yeah, 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 just a second. What the hell are you even looking for? Evidence. You were talking with Greenlee. All right, one last time for the thick-headed. 
I don't have a clue as to where she is. Yeah, you know, either that or maybe you just covered your tracks. You can let him go. But if I find out, you know where Greenlee is. All right, you know what? Save the threats. You two numbskulls don't even have a clue as to what you're messing with. People's lives. Andy Hubbard's eyesight is at stake. So the next time you clowns want to play Batman and Robin, you might be wise to remember that. Hayward? <laughs> that son of a bitch had you the entire time? Dad. I'll kill him. Dad. No, I'll kill him. You know I will, Dixie. I can do it. He can't get away with this. Not again. Dad. All right? I'm sick of him playing God. Dad. Dixie? I, I don't Dixie. want to talk about it. David. Okay. 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 Calm down. Calm down. It's hard. Take a deep breath. Just, just take a deep breath. You gotta come here, come here, come here. You gotta remember your heart, honey. It's all right. It's all right. I've got you. I've got you.